Rummy nose tetra are a beautiful and one of the most popular fish among fish keepers. They are tropical freshwater fish and is native to South American rivers. Not only does it sport a unique look, but it is also a peaceful fish with shoaling behavior that makes it a lovely addition to a community tank. Most of their body is plain silver. Their head is a deep red which gives them their name. Their body is a torpedo shape with short and clear fins. Let's take a look at some of the most suitable tank mates for rummy nose tetra. Welcome to Finding Fishes, let's get started. Cherry barbs are brightly colored and beautiful fish. They are hardy fish which makes these fish perfect for experts or beginners. They belong to the Saprinidae family. These fish are a tropical species that comes from Sri Lanka. Due to their schooling behavior, they bring so much color and activity to the middle of your tank. It's important to keep cherry barbs in a group to prevent them from going into hiding and being really shy. Cherry barbs are fairly active fish that will spend a lot of their time moving in the tank. Because of their peaceful nature, they should be a great tank mate for rummy nose tetra. Rummy nose tetra and discus can potentially be suitable tank mates. This pairing will ultimately boil down to the temperature the tetras are kept at. Discus require warm water temperatures of 82 to 86 degrees Fahrenheit, which could potentially be too warm for the rummy nose tetra, as their water temperature should not exceed 82 degrees. Also, when pairing these two species, the rummy nose tetra should be added to the tank first to establish their territory. Doing so will prevent the discus from seeing them as a snack. Discus should be kept in groups, like the rummy nose tetra, as this will prevent any aggressive tendencies. Risboras are very popular for home aquariums because of their fun group behaviors and striking colors. This species is loved by aquarists because of their ease of care and stunning appearance. Harlequin risboras are a great example of an easy shoaling fish to add to your tank. They are striking fish that, when added as part of a group, will add a vibrant splash of color to your tank. They are very peaceful. They won't nip on the tails of other fish or show any signs of aggression. These schooling fish will group up and spend their time exploring the habitat together. They will be a great tank mate for Aminos tetra. The neon tetra is a freshwater fish belonging to the tetra fish family. Neon tetras have vibrant blue bodies with striking red markings from the belly to the tail. Because of their hardiness, neon tetras have low care needs, making the fish a popular choice for beginner fish keepers. Neon tetras are found in the northern and western Amazon basins in Peru, Brazil, and Colombia. Neon tetras are commonly mistaken for cardinal tetras. While they do look similar, the biggest difference is the size of the red stripe. For neon tetras, the stripe only crosses half of the body. For cardinal tetras, it runs through the entire length of the fish. They will be a great tank mate for rummy nose tetra. The Cory catfish is one of the most loved freshwater fishes for aquarists of all experience levels. They are peaceful, hardy fish that don't harass their tank mates. The fish are popular amongst aquarists due to their calm temperaments and unique appearance. Cory catfish are found in regions all across South America, from the Andes Mountains to the Atlantic coast. The fish live in slow-moving, clear shallow streams with sediment and a sandy riverbed. They look fantastic, they're easy to care for, and they are super friendly. They will be a good tank mate for rummy nose tetra. Gauramis are freshwater fish native to southeastern Asia and come in a wide range of colors and patterns. Not only are they beautiful, but they're easy to care for as well. Gauramis are popular with fish keepers due to their gentle nature, affordability, and hardiness. Gauramis thrive in low oxygenated water in the wild. The fish can breathe in oxygen from the air because Gauramis have a unique supplemental breathing structure, the labyrinth organ. They swim in the top and middle levels of the tank and often swim to the surface to breathe air. They will be great tank mates for rummy nose tetra. That's it for today guys, hope you really enjoyed the video, keep supporting us and stay tuned for more such interesting videos. Finding fishes remember the name.